Hey, how's it going? And today I wanted to give you a quick modeling tip. I'm not much of a modeler, but I do like to dabble in it. And there's sometimes when I want to make something, but just maybe something very basic. So one thing you might want to make or people might want to make is a building, which is very common. One thing I found to simplify it, to make it easy, to make a basic building, is if we just go to box and I'll click and drag, left click and drag, and I'll just click up here to make a box. It, it really couldn't be easier. I want it to be an office building type box. Well, before I do anything else, just at this stage, once I have the basic box in existence, all I have to do is go to numeric here, and I can just create segments on the X, Y, and Z. And I have a saying almost that it's better to have segments and not need them than to need them and not have them. The beauty of creating segments is, I'll show you, it makes it very easy to punch out holes or assign surfaces to windows and doors because if you're going to have a building, you're going to want to have windows and doors, obviously. So anyway, once you've got that done, you can just hit enter, and now it's locked everything kind of in. And then if you hit F3, you can put, rest this on the ground in the center. There's kind of our primitive office building, let's say, right there. But now let's say I wanted to either punch out some holes for windows or I wanted to make a door to open this. Well, if I didn't have segments, I'd have to go in here and let me make this big in the scene. Let's say I wanted to make a door. Now all I could do is just make sure I'm on polygon selection, hold shift, and I can just select the poly polygons that I want to punch out. So I could either change the surface as more than likely. I would just, if I wanted to assign this to, let's say, a glass surface, I would just hit Q, and now I can assign it, those polygons, as a door. But let's say I wanted to make some more windows or some windows up here. All I have to do is select those, and I could either assign a surface by hitting a Q, or let's say I want... I will actually want to punch a hole through there. I can just delete those polygons. You can just delete these polygons or reassign them to a different surface. So that is the tip. And it just makes it a lot easier to make a building, punch out holes and stuff. Otherwise, you'd be trying to cut them out somehow, adding polygons. It just, it would be a lot more difficult, I think. And this just makes it really easy then to create a basic prototype building. Take care and have a great day.